Strong winds and pounding rain is leaving a major mess across Kern County tonight. Let's head to Oildale, where 23 ABC's Ken Masenchi found a large tree that fell there as well and damaged a trailer. Ken? Tim out here in Oildale, where as you can see behind me, this tree toppled over because of the storm, taking the fence with it because one part of the tree was on a neighbor's yard. The other half was outside of the fence area, fell into another neighbor's yard, taking out the video or sorry, the window in the uh, trailer back there, but it also took out a power line. And that power line you can see up there, uh, PG&E came and rolled it up. The, uh, the power line had been live down here on the ground for a while. Kern County Fire came out and made sure no one could walk through the alleyway until it was picked up by PG&E about an hour ago. And some of the neighbors here talked about the shock of hearing this loud boom when the tree fell down. It was very overwhelming and just a big shock to see that it could have been worse. You know, I work in that area a lot, getting things cleaned up, and it could have been me under that tree today. It's a loud bang, like watching TV, and then all of a sudden it shuts off, and it, like, I thought it was like an earthquake or something. And so we just went out and checked it, and then we saw that you guys were out here, and we're like, something really bad happened. <laughs> PG&E says this storm presents a good reminder to keep flashlights with fresh batteries inside just in case a power line does go down and knocks out power. And a power line, if you do see one on the ground, what you are to do is to call 911 and PG&E and stay away. Live in Oildale, Ken Masenchi, 23ABC.